Yellow, Dallas here, that's Hannah. This is a giant bag full of McDonald's toys. I can see a few cool things poking out the side here. We picked this up at the thrift. And as soon as I saw it, I said, I'm not gonna dig through that. We're gonna take it home. We're gonna open it up on this channel and see if anything brings back any memories. So stick around. Okay, full disclaimer before we jump into this bag. Maybe it's not all McDonald's. Maybe we'll get in here and we'll be able to tell some of it's Burger King or other fast food restaurants. But at any rate, this is a bag full of fast food toys. And I'll tell you what, I think there's gonna be some nostalgia inducing stuff in here. But before we jump into it, I want you guys to comment below and please, pretty please do this for me. Comment below and let us know which fast food toy specifically that you're the most nostalgic for. Can you think of anything from your childhood? I have one okay. in mind. Well, don't tell me. We'll talk about <laughs> ours at the end. I actually don't know right off the top of my head, but I'm hoping something in this bag might knock it a little bit loose. There's going to be a lot to talk about here. Um, we were walking around the thrift store, and uh, we were doing some stuff for our other channel, and I spotted this, and I said, we're going to take it home and tear it apart. You ready for this? Should we just dump it out, you think? Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. All right, we lost a couple. What even is that? Okay, it wasn't all out of the bag. Okay, there's oh, definitely some me. things in here I'm excited about. There's definitely some things in here I haven't thought about since I was a kid. I don't know where to start. Oh my gosh. How are we gonna do that? Let's just, let's just push it all over here. Let's just grab one thing by the next. I don't think this is a fast food toy, do you? Couldn't be. Like, you couldn't get that in one of those little McDonald's receptacle things that they had yeah. on display. You never know sometimes with McDonald's. But uh, let's just take different items and slide them over. And I'll tell you something I want to start with. And if the rest of this is in here, I'm going to lose my mind. you know who goes in there? Because I do. No, I don't. I 100% remember this. Please tell me you guys remember this. Taz goes in here. Oh, really? This is his, like, the Flash, but Taz suit. Like, That's incredible. So if we find a little Taz, I'm going to lose my mind. And here's why this is such a problem. Here's why I didn't want to do this video. I'm going to want to start completing the sets of most of these. Because <laughs> there's several things in here that there's several of, right? Yeah. So let's scoot him aside. I wonder if Taz just got thrown around the room somewhere. He's probably not in here. Okay, let's just keep going. Grab something that seems familiar to you. Oh my gosh! Ah! One of those! Here, get down, get down here on this. Oh, it's so good! <laughs> it's so good. Do you remember that? Yes, you had we had that kid? one. All right, well, it just says Disney on it. We're not going to make a big deal whether or not they were McDonald's, but it definitely looks very McDonald's, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, do you know who this is? Um, I don't. That's Jubilee from the X-Men. Ah. I remember that. I definitely had that when I was a kid. Oh! Let's go. I wonder if there's any more from this set in there. There was only one episode of the show, and I can't remember the Nike's World? It's Bobby. Bobby's World. And it's, um, there was a scene where they're like, Bobby, they're counting on you, and he, like, imagines the numbers falling from the sky and, like, <laughs> just dropping on his head. Like, he's driving around his car trying to, like, miss them all. So you only remember the nightmare scene. I only remember that one scene. Weird. All right. <laughs> um, well, okay. This is pretty cool. Oh, yeah, it's like, just, you can fit his yeah, yeah, feet yeah. in there, yeah. He's like a transformer. He's a piece of meat. He's very weird. <laughs> Not really on brand with McDonald's marketing ploys these days, I think. A lot of their stuff. There's another Bobby. Oh my gosh. That's awesome. Uh, what about you guys? Comment below. Is any of this making you think of other things from McDonald's or Burger King? What is that? That's a McDonald's camera, or is it a tape player? It kind of looks like a talk boy. Interesting. A little magnifying it, action. It is. It's a little retracting. I've never seen this. Now, since we've got enough people watching, I'm hoping some of you guys will know what some of this stuff is below and comment if you recall anything else that was in the set. It's probably some sort of spy gear set from McDonald's. Now, let's go on to another one. I do remember this. It's like a... a, a is it from Magic School Bus? Yes, it's from Magic School Bus. It's got the planets, the identifiers to help you remember them. Do you remember them? Can you say them in order? 
Oh, the planets? Yeah, that's easy, right? Well, there's a song from Blue's Clues that I remember. <laughs> well, the cool. sun's a hot star, Mercury's hot too. Okay, Venus don't sing too much of it, we're going to get... <laughs> there's some to me and you. I don't know what it was when I was a kid, me and my little brother liked to memorize things. So it was Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto, if you're into that kind of thing. <laughs> and Pluto, if you're and then into that kind Dasher, of thing. Dancer, Prancer, Mixer, Comic, Cupid, Donner, and Blitzen. That memorizing things was my thing as a kid. That's cool. I remember that vaguely. Here's another one of those Transformers. I'm, I'm going to have to go look some of this stuff up whenever we're done. Because we're going to like have the whole set of something here. All right, let's keep moving. Let's grab a company. Here's another one of those. All right, so well, two of the apple. And we've got the piece of meat. And here's the Sammy. <gasps> I remember the Sammy. I do too. I remember all of these. The Sammy, I think, was the one we actually had. So cool. All right, well, let me grab a couple of these. I actually have a few of these in my collection. There's Knuckles, and there's Dr. Robotnik, or Eggman, or whatever you want to call them. Uh, there might have been another Sonic one in here. There's just another, another. Knuckles. Okay. Um, all right, well, check this out. Here's another Transformer foodie. This is really cool. You guys are going to have to comment below and let me know what you think. Do I have to collect this whole set now? Because, like, <laughs> we have to almost have all of it. We've got Apple, Very close. Ice Cream Cone, and Meat Man. Is that it? Well, two we apples, got two apples. Yeah. Okay, there might be more of them in here. All right, let's keep moving. I feel uh, like we had a lot of this stuff. Yeah, I know. That's kind of the thing. Hannah and I both kind of grew up in households that did a little thrifting or did a little yard selling. All of my toys came from yard sales. So even if I didn't get these from McDonald's, I'm about to lose my mind. Did you see what I just saw? No, I didn't. I got to go show this camera. Hold on. <gasps> I had this when I was a kid. I'm not kidding you. And I just, I used to act like Taz was, you know, I was like, I was just like Andy in Toy Story doing stuff. And then I'd be like, and then Taz morphs into Flash Taz. I'm serious. That's if, so cute. If there, was any, if there was ever anything meant to be on my shelf, that was it. He's not going to live on the Pokemon shelf. Maybe he'll make a little more sense over here with the rest of the superheroes. I don't know. <laughs> I didn't, I can't believe I didn't see that sitting over there. All right, we've got more Bobby stuff. Nice. I, the, this, that was what was so crazy about this big bag setting in Goodwill. Uh, when it was, I saw it was that big and I could kind of peek in the sides. Like here's, actually I'll tell you what I saw. And Those. honestly, yeah, we'll, we'll do these next. I saw, I saw a multitude of these stringy things. I didn't see enough to be able to tell that there was two of two different ones and one of another. But I saw there were so many, I thought, if nothing else, the $6 for that bag would probably be worth having the whole set of these. Cause I do, I don't have them on display, but I do have two or three of this dinosaur shows toys. Um, yeah, we nice. had these. Yeah. I think- Do you just, remember them? Yeah, I think we had the mom and I think that was it. But that purpley color switch thing looks really familiar to me. That's yeah. why I think we had the mom. It just makes them all do a little jig. <laughs> um, I, and, and you know what, this is kind of the problem with this now. I don't really want to go to thrift stores doing our thrifting thing we normally do and then spend all my time looking for McDonald's toys. But like, it's very easy. It's so easy to fall into an obsession with these things. Do you know what I mean? They're really cool. It just makes them do a little jig. It's so funny. That's wild. This, this is still blowing yeah. my mind. Yeah, it is mine too. So like, this might have to live on the shelf for a little while. Maybe if I find out we have a complete something or other, it'll probably live on the shelves. I'm not trying to get into a bunch of toy collecting, especially McDonald's toy collecting, but for the sake of this channel, I think it'll be cool if things just live on the shelf for a while in the backgrounds of our videos. All right, so we need to keep those together because we've got four so far. You know what? I don't know. Look at this. It's just a little spaceship. I don't think it but has it anything to do with Taz yet. similar yeah. to the Taz look thing. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we'll find something else that goes to. Hmm. Uh, all right, let's keep moving. More Bobby's World. We've got so much of this. I wonder if we do have the full set. Like, look at that one. Yeah, we'll have to see. Then we've got him on skates. What else do we have? We've got him in his car so so far. It's a big set, big portion of it at least. And like I said before we started this video, I did not know what was in here. and I was pretty clueless. So if we're calling some of this stuff by the wrong name, it's just who we are as people. <laughs> Here's another one of these. Okay. So I don't know... Um, Does it go with one of these things? We've got some McDonald's footballs. These are kind of goofy, but they it's are. weird. There's multiple ones. Is this a basketball? Yeah, uh, there's a basketball. But I guess it's a basketball, football, and it's a rugby, isn't it? What do you uh, actually... So it just says... Does it say Michael Jordan? Whoa. Hold on. That's weird, isn't it? It's very I don't interesting. Know. It's cool. 
No, it's somebody else. Yeah, it's Michael Jordan on it. That's weird. I remember that. Do you okay. remember that? Yell into it. It vibrates inside. <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> listen. Listen to this. <laughs> Hello. Do you remember that? I do. Well we, well, we didn't have this one. We had one that was like mega, mega big. Super it was like mega. We've like bought it at the store. Uh, that's pretty awesome. I don't know what it was from. I guess, yeah, just Nickelodeon. It's a Nickelodeon slime thing. Uh, ridiculous is what it is. It's absolutely ridiculous. Here's something from the Flintstones, and I thought maybe I saw something else from the Flintstones. I don't know. Maybe not. I guess we'll set it aside and see. Now this, I don't think that's a McDonald's toy. Uh, it looks like no. it. Yeah, it's just a little wind-up scarecrow. Get that. Get that action. He's very. He's walking. He's very top heavy. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, let's keep moving on. Maybe we'll find something these go in. What does that say on the front of it? Bobby's. It's Bobby. It's... Oh my gosh! Oh, Pull the car! Oh, off. Pull the car! Oh, off. We we solved the puzzle. Oh. He's, he, he's on a wagon. Oh my gosh! You gotta be smarter than the car, though. You can do it. Yeah. I believe in you. No, no, what have I done? Does it, does does it only go with specific ones? Because he's, no, his head's backwards, that's why. Well, maybe it goes on like, like this one goes on a trike or something. His head's backward, too. I don't know, but we're getting closer here. There are removable tops, so like, what would this skate go on? They say Bobby's World, so that goes on something from Bobby's World. But we don't know what yet. So let's just leave all that together. At any rate, we've got a lot of Bobby's World stuff. That's crazy. I bet you this is from whatever this is from. Yeah. Here's another one. Some of you, yep, there's another one. Some of you guys are gonna remember this stuff, so let us know. Hold on. That's not something you remember, right? No. Is it a magnifying glass? No, it's just a little thing. You pull the trigger and you can see through it, almost like the aperture of the lens is opening up. Interesting. Okay, interesting. It's ridiculous how many of some of these things are in here. She's broken. No, I thought about collecting stuff with some of this, but that's broken. She's missing wheels. Here's another camera. There's another one from that Ooh. set. I'm telling you. There's two. There's some stuff here we've almost got sets from. What do you think that's from? There's a McDonald's watch. It's a compass. Interesting. It's a fake watch, but a real compass. If I were to guess, I would say Inspector Gadget, but I remember the Inspector Gadget. Not that, yeah, that was not that was not that one. Another another Moon Man. I don't think that's McDonald's, is it? Probably not. Well, some of it I get so curious about because McDonald's just, you know, it seems unreal sometimes how often McDonald's changes their toys. Do you know what that is? I do. All right. Oh, it's Tiny so Toons. It's but, or, uh, Buster on this side, and then you flip it over and it's Elmira. No way. Oh my gosh, we had that one. No way. So cool. <laughs> All right, well, there's Doc Brown. There's a <clears throat> random turtle. Oh, what is this? Do you know what this is? I do. Oh, I didn't know. I actually didn't know it was Lion King. It makes sense now. It's so cool. We had a couple of these when I was a kid. I just, and I didn't remember it was Lion King either, but I remembered the box. You remember the lion in the box? Yeah, and it, it was it was scar side down. We didn't see that. That's awesome. <laughs> okay, well, I actually do remember these Barbie toys. Uh, we had, I had two of these, and they honestly were sandbox toys for me. Oh, really? You had a sandbox? Had, I did. You had a fancy childhood. <laughs> We I had just, a just tractor played, tire filled with sand. I just played in the mud. <laughs> and she had her glasses that flipped up. They're so cool. Ours are disgusting and covered in dirt now. That's awesome. But <laughs> Here, hold on to this. I do remember this thing. I do too. Um, I don't remember. What is it? Earth. What does that say? Earth Day. So it's just an Earth Day toy. It's a pair of binoculars. And my eyes are too wide set. It actually kind of works okay. Do you remember that? Well, I remember that. I thought that. it went this way. Well, that, it, that shrunk vision for me. Interesting. Did it not you? I yeah. can't tell. No, this is definitely the right way. Look through <laughs> that side, see? Have I been doing this wrong my whole life? <laughs> Most likely. Um, okay. There's a kitty cat. There's more of the stuff from Tiny Toons. Those are yeah? so cute. Well, I, I didn't pay close enough attention. Were some of these, is that Tiny Toons or Looney Toons? Tiny Toons. Yeah, Tiny Toons. So all that stuff was Tiny Toons. We're, we're figuring this out as we go. <laughs> and what do you... I dropped it. What do you guys might have to comment below? What are these? Do you know uh, these? I don't. I don't either. Does it say? No. Hasbro 1985. 
There's something from Hasbro. I mean, they look vaguely familiar to me, but uh, this is weird. Now oh, that's from that Flintstones thing. I do remember oh, this stuff. Neat. It was when the movie came out with John Goodman, who is amongst my favorite actors. That was a good uh, Flintstones yeah, movie. Yeah, good. Not, oh, here's the back door for it. Oh, is that the rest of it? Or is that a, an for, additional yeah, door? Yeah, <laughs> it's for another one. <laughs> um, rescuers Down Under. It's a little Rescuers Down Under camera. <gasps> you know what it is? Oh! No! We're going to have to figure out how to share this experience with you guys. Hold I on. I feel like that would like go into Here. your pupil. And... No, hold on. Spin this little wheel. Oh, we're going to get this. Y'all going to see now. Oh, you got to spin it. There you go. Hold on. Hold on. I moved it. Do it. Spin. Keep oh my spinning. gosh, that's so cool. Keep going. It's actually really hard to turn. It's really hard to do. <laughs> Slower. Bro, it's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, there was a clever camera trick. That's so cool. Okay, and then the Goofy movie. Max. Uh, these are not for the same thing, but there's a Batmobile and Weird a Joker, Joker with a ramming Joker head. Elvira, but she's a sticky window thing. Um, and her name's not Elvira. <laughs> what is wrong with me? I instantly knew that was wrong. That's not. Well, let me just say this. Is a flute? <laughs> That's damn weird. Isn't that what it is? I think it's a recorder. Well, I'm Ready? About, I'm about to get the Rona. <laughs> get some germs. I think it's missing a piece. Like the mouthpiece, maybe? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, well, I got the Rona now. Um, one Smurf Pez. Another Doc Brown. I remember this. It's a Polly Pocket. <gasps> but it's one of the McDonald's. This was McDonald's, right? This is a McDonald's Polly Pocket. That's wonderful. Polly Pocket is actually something I've always wanted to find at the thrift, but still haven't been able to find it. I'm 99% certain I went to McDonald's and I got this. You went to McDonald's and I got this. Here, check it. Oh, is it the... It's the, the, the I forget what they were called. Mini, mini mics? Mike, Mighty Mighty Mikes. I don't remember. That's so cool. Yes. 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 That's awesome. <laughs> that's so awesome. That's another one I wouldn't mind having the whole set up. That's scary, yeah, honestly. It is, it is a little bit. Um, a little kaleidoscope. There. Yeah, here. Well, let's, let's show them how it works. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's so yellow. <laughs> that's so great. It's rubber duck yellow. Hey. Okay. Um... Flashlight. So that must again be from that. We've done made a mess here, but yeah, it's from this set of nonsense. It is like some sort of weird survival. That's, it's supposed to actually be a telescope. That's so silly. Uh, Bert and Ernie, or just one of them. Now we're all. getting down to super. No oh wow! Oh yeah! That's old. Okay, there's another. There's a Smurf, and there's Fred himself, John Goodman, Donald. So. Let's talk about all the stuff we just went through real quick. Let's talk about what you actually, now that you've seen this all, what you remember playing with the most. And then we can talk about some other things. What do you, out of all this, what do you remember playing with the most? Um, well, I mean, out of the toys that we got here? Yeah. Probably this. Because, honestly, the thing that I remember the most about McDonald's toys was that bucket of sandbox toys we had. And they were all just... Not sandbox toys at all, they, but they were mostly Barbies. So. Interesting. Well, I actually remember having these guys. I really do. I remember playing with them just religiously. It was that idea of transforming, like Transformers or Power Rangers, this Morphin Time kind of thing. And that Taz with the suit. I would always make these team-ups of toys where I would be like, it's Morphin Time, and I would make them change. That's so cool. I, yeah, so I think out of all this... I'm going to tell you what I'm going to keep, and I'm going to tell you what's a runner-up. I'm okay. going to keep the Taz, and I'm going to figure out what set he was from. And I don't know, you know, I'm sure there was a Bugs version of something. If they were all superheroes, and I think they were, because I'm pretty sure I remember a Daffy Duck in a superhero costume. And if that's the case, I will work tirelessly to... Tyler... I will work <laughs> tirelessly to collect that whole set. So I think I'm going to keep those, and then I'm going to keep the meat people... And I think that's going to be it for me. Now, is there anything in this collection down here that you would like to keep that or collect? I would have to keep. Gosh. And I would like to know from you guys. If you guys brought this big bag home, is there any of it that you'd be like, oh, i got to keep that? 
I'm curious to know, because there's some of this tempting, but like I, I don't want to clutter myself up too much. Yeah, and like the thing that I got the most excited about was this thing. If I found all of those, I would be really happy about it. But as far as like being absolutely obsessed with it, no. Yeah. But the thing that you said, what, what McDonald's story that we remember the most, yeah. I will want to collect all those. What's that? The 101 Dalmatians. Oh my gosh. You know I what? I loved them. <laughs> Given how many of those there were. Impossible. <laughs> it was, well, yeah, that's not what I was going to say. We, we're, we're trying to collect all the Pokemon cards. We know about collecting the impossible. But I'm just thinking, as many of those as there were when we were kids, we stepped on them all the time, they were everywhere. I haven't seen a lot in yeah. our thrifting town. I've seen a couple. But it's not like a pandemic like I thought it would be yeah. by now. Um, that's a good one. So, that was the question I asked at the beginning of the video, right? What what, what did I ask? What did I say we were going to talk about? What was the, the McDonald's toy that you were the most nostalgic for? The McDonald's toy that I'm most nostalgic for? Well, to be honest with you, I was hoping this would knock something loose. And I will say, I had the superhero Looney Tunes stuff when I was a kid. And I, uh, I, I all of a sudden, I just, I remember those so clearly. So, so clearly. So I'm going to go with that one. Um, as far as the other toys that came from McDonald's and stuff, uh, something outside of this pile, I'll go ahead and show you this. This is actually part of my collection. Get a good look at that bad boy. There was a whole set of these Power Rangers. Just Pikachu like, is making him very hard to see. Oh, she blends in. <laughs> that right there, there was one for each Power Ranger. It was from the movies. And uh, I only have the... I have I have another figure. I know. I have her... Yellow Zord, and I had the blue Zord, but no other figures, none of the other Zords. And that is what I'd like to have a complete collection of. And even cooler, they did this anniversary thing with McDonald's toys recently, where the whole month's worth of toys was just one remake from a lot of generations, and the Red Power Ranger was one of the ones that remade, and it was really cool. That's awesome. I didn't end up ever getting one, but that was really cool. So, let's wrap this up, but I do want to know from you guys two things. Seriously. Just in general, before all of this, what toys popped up in your mind that you played with for McDonald's and then also out of all this nonsense, what would you keep? I'm honestly going to spend a little bit more time on these Bobby figures. I'm very curious yeah, why, how that works. I think we're just missing a lot of the other ones. Yeah. I don't think they're supposed to be modular and all work together. Um, but that's pretty cool and I'm pretty happy about it. This brought back memories for sure. Well, here's what I need you guys to do. I need you guys to hit that subscribe button just in case for no reason at all next week I find another big bag of McDonald's toys and we have to continue this as a series or something because I don't want to be a McDonald's toy collector but I'm in love right now and I can't <laughs> wait to wrap up this video and play with them a little bit more. So hit that subscribe button, turn those notifications on. We're, uh, we're not going to be a daily video channel. We do that on our other channel. It's a lot of work. But I am going to be posting videos every day for a little while just so our page isn't blank. So that when you come to Rubber Duck Yellow, you see a page full of videos and you're like, this is a cool place to be. So definitely come back tomorrow probably and you'll see another video in probably a few more days. And then after that, we'll find some other sort of manageable schedule. Uh, but this is the kind of thing you can definitely expect on this channel. Just some random toy and trading card game and other cool thing awesomeness is what I'm saying. So come back next time come back tomorrow i don't know which just make sure you come back and check this out at some point and until then guys peace out